Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another quick video. So I'm here with a Samsung Galaxy A17 5G Android phone. And in this video, I'll be showing you how to enable the edge panels and also I'll be showing you how to customize the panels. Okay, so to turn on the edge panels, just follow my steps. Pull down the notification bar and go into the settings and then scroll down to where it says display. And then scroll down again to where it says edge panels. Go ahead and turn it on and then select edge panels. So just tap on it. And now you are inside the edge panel settings. So from here you can customize the panels. Okay, so the edge panels, it's a customizable shortcut bar that appears on the edge of the screen when you swipe from a specific handle. So if you look here, you will see the handle. Now that it's enabled, you'll see this little handle. If you swipe out, as you can see, it brings out the edge panel. So this is the default panel that contains your applications. And if you select the little pencil down here, you can actually customize this panel and add any of your applications, your default applications or your downloaded applications. You can add them to the empty box. So for example, if you want to add YouTube, you would obviously just select YouTube. And as you can see, another empty box has appeared. So if I want to add TikTok, I would add TikTok. So you can see another empty box has appeared. So I can add as many of these applications that I want. So I've just added YouTube, TikTok, and the Play Store. And at any point, if you want to remove any application from the Edge panel, just simply select the little minus sign beside each of the applications. So as you can see, I've just removed those applications that I just added. And like I says, any downloaded application, you can also add to the empty box. Okay, so here, if you select panels, you will see some more edge panels that you can add. So like I showed you, we have the apps, we have people, which is your contacts, tasks, weather, tools, clipboard and reminder. So I'm just going to add two of my favorite ones. I like to see the weather and also tools as well. Okay, so now when I swipe out from the handle, I have the apps, like I showed you. If I swipe out again, I now have the weather. If I swipe out again, I have a compass. And if I select this option here, can use the tally counter. So these are all the tools, the torch. Also, if you're a builder, if you like to build things, you can use the service level to maybe check your wall to see if it's level, see if it's straight. And we also have a ruler, so you can use it to check your measurements. And then here, we have the handle option. So here you can customize the handle, so you can change its position. So. Because I'm right-handed, it's on the right-hand side. However, you can change it to the left-hand side. And as you can see, it's now over here on the left-hand side. But I'm going to switch it back over to the right. Also, you can lock the handle position so it doesn't move. And you can also change the color. So at the moment, it's white. As you can see, it's white. You can change it to any one of the colors. So now it's red, you can change it to orange, yellow, green, blue, purple. And you can also make your own color. 
and then just hit done so now it's this lightish blue color don't know if you can see and you can also change the transparency so you can have it set to high medium or low and you can also change the size from small to medium and large in fact let me change it to red again so you can see it a bit better so there it is so as you can see you can change it from small to medium to large and you can also change the width from thin all the way to thick So yeah, I think I've pretty much covered everything here regarding the edge panels. And up here in the top right hand corner, if you select this option, you can change the order. You can uninstall and you can hide on the lock screen. So yeah, that's it for the video. This was just my video showing you how to turn on and enable the edge panels on the Samsung Galaxy A17 5G and also how to customize the edge panels as well. So you can see the handle there a bit better now. But yeah, that's it for the video. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Hope this video helped you out. If it did do, be sure to give the video a thumbs up. Share the video. It's your boy, the Android Doctor. And I will definitely see you all in the next video. I'm out. Deuces.